Here is a um, six port 1147cc head. Um, they originally had this really long brass sleeve going down this port and um, the casting was open from this side to this side and you can normally stick your finger in there and it's open all the way across in that sleeve um, directed the flow to this side to flow around and back and then um, this goes out to the thermostat to the radiator so if you take that sleeve out you have this really open hole here and it would flow over the least resistance so I've brazed a plate in there so now it's actually locked off so it can only flow from one side to the other without crossing. Looking at the 1300 heads and the later heads including the GT6 heads it always flows from one side to the other um, for the water pump as it should. So um, I'm guessing this early head design was an afterthought. I don't know when they put the sleeve in. Uh, the standard 10 head that I have, I'm not sure if it has a sleeve in it or not but uh, I would assume it's the same casting but I haven't pulled my standard 10 head apart to look at it but um, if I take the head, um, the head off or the water pump I'll have to look and see so I heated this whole head up to about 450 degrees I actually die grind a step in there and stick this piece of uh, that's about a sixteenth of an inch steel plate um, stick it in a step, heated it up, heated the whole head up, braised it in, and it cooled for about two hours. Uh, I heated it as it was cooling so it wouldn't crack, and it seems to be perfectly fine. There's a couple small little gaps, but that's fine as long as it flows. So, um, still got to blast it and rebuild it, but um, I'll have it uh, Magnaflex just in case. But, um, that's the uh, brazing on the head for the water flow.